Steer. Change gears. Accelerate. Things we've been familiar with for years, but I can assure you there are enormous differences. We will continue on our path as a technology and innovation leader, and you will certainly experience this today. Today, you can already experience the technology of tomorrow. I'm here at a truly exclusive event. In the run-up to the IAA, ZF has invited international journalists to Germany. I'm especially delighted to have the opportunity to actually feel these individual innovations in real time. Even for international journalists, it is surprising to see how big ZF is. More than 70,000 employees in 26 countries are developing innovations for the automotive industry. Of course, also members of the group's board of management have joined us here on site. Hands-on technology, a technological experience, feeling the technology. That's what ZF is doing at this event. What a huge effort, Mr. Hunkel. Why such an effort? Well, in the run-up to the IAA in September, we want to give the journalists the opportunity to experience our products, ZF's overall portfolio, and to understand it all. And we're talking about a wide range of products. We have driveline products right up to whole driveline systems, and then we have the chassis. So we can use our entire portfolio to enhance mobility and efficiency. The automotive year 2013 is essential for ZF because in many cases the course will be set for future technologies. This applies to lightweight design, the use of new materials, the application of new construction and design principles, as well as the structure of driveline in the transition phase, electrification, right up to purely electric drives. And in a moment, we will take the cars on the test track. One could think that ZF has cleared out the last test car departments of premium manufacturers. We have a hybrid drive, a seven-speed manual transmission, active damping systems for motorcycles, the eight-speed automatic transmission on the brand new Jaguar F-Type. Whether I would take the posh Jag or this bulky model, that is a real prototype with an electric drive, a model you can actually drive and experience, just like the nine-speed automatic transmission that is installed here in the Range Rover Evoque. Im Range Rover Evoque auf die Strecke kommt. Motion and mobility. Motion and mobility. There could be no better place to discover this than at ZF's chassis station. You can try out ZF chassis technology in compact models like the BMW 1 Series, right up to heavy SUVs like the Mercedes ML or the Nissan Infiniti. The dynamics of the cars are very responsive and the feedback to the driver is uh, really, really good. It was a great steering pleasure, a very direct feel. Somewhere hidden between the electric drive, transmission, and steering solutions, we've discovered an almost revolutionary thing. The times in which you couldn't back into a parking space with your big boat are a thing of the past. Just get out of the car and steer the vehicle with its trailer via your smartphone or tablet and perfectly park your car. It's unbelievable. I'm really impressed. It's a bit like science fiction. At this station, we give journalists an impression of the CDC, continuous damping control. It continuously adjusts the damping force in a characteristic curve, always a perfect match for the vehicle situation.
sportly. Sporty, yeah, impressive, and I was quite glad there was little traffic. Click, 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 and there we were in seventh gear. Transmission is very fast. I'm driving an absolute world's first, ZF's nine-speed automatic transmission. I was afraid that with nine speeds, it would be just like a continuously variable automatic transmission. This is a beautiful multi-ratio transmission. Actually, this is the best front automatic transmission I have ever driven. All the OEMs have had to, to sit up and think about what they're going to do to compete with the 9HP. Also with electrification, ZF is showing the whole gamut of what's possible here in Schlüsselfeld. ZF technology is installed in many mature hybrid models, in the VW Jetta, the Audi Q5, and the BMW 5 Series. On board here is the 8-speed hybrid transmission. Just push a button and you change into the E-mode, where you can drive up to 4 kilometers and up to 60 kilometers per hour purely electrically. That doesn't sound like much, though, does it? That's why there is another particularly powerful solution. Surprisingly dynamic, the vehicle has a very good performance. It's actually fun. Normally electric cars are not fun, but uh, this had some really strong acceleration. Once you're on board the ZF prototype, you ask yourself why there aren't more electric vehicles out there. You can drive 120 kilometers every day with zero local emissions. The technology is absolutely mature, and it is fun. You really get things moving. And electric mobility is getting even cheaper now because basically ZF can supply this package to any manufacturer and install it right away. This is motion and mobility for everyone.